Al-Islam, Al-Islam, it teaches us about rulers. Okay, it teaches us about rulers. So the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam told us that, you know, there's going to come after me people. You're going to see a great, great deal of harm from them. The companion said, should we fight them, O Messenger of Allah? And I'm just, I'm just uh, sort of summarizing the reports. And in some narrations, the Messenger of Allah said, they're going to have the hearts of devils in the bodies of men. I think that hadith you're mentioning now is in Sahih Muslim. Uh, it, 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 with, with varying wordings that you're right. And there's other narrations where the Messenger of Allah says, you know, they're going to beat your backs and they're going to take your wealth. And so quite... You know, imagine Maybe, uh, very, description. very uh, stern description from the Messenger of and Allah. Not a good one at that. Not a good one. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna beat your backs. They're gonna take your wealth. You know, they're gonna oppress you. They're going to have the, the the hearts of devils in the bodies of men. This is a serious description. The companions were like, "Should we fight them? Should we kill them? What should we do on that day?" And the Messenger of Allah told us in so many narrations, "Upon you is to hear and obey. Hear and obey." Okay, hear and obey, and in other narrations, give them their rights, meaning hear and obey them, and ask Allah for your rights. And in other narrations, he would say, be patient until you meet me at the Hawd, meaning on Yawm Al-Qiyam. Just to pause right there. Some people say that, look, you know, uh, if they tell us to commit shirk, we're not going, going to obey them in that. So this hadith is being misused. There are specific times and there are, there are specific things and general things. So one of the general principles in Al-Islam is that there is no obedience to the creation if it means disobedience to creator. So anything that where we're talking about obedience, it's under that general umbrella and yeah. it's a specific thing. Okay. So there's only obedience to those rulers when it means that we don't disobey Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But the point being the companions asked, do we kill them? Should we rebel? Should, Should we, we fight, fight them? them? Protest against and them. And the Messenger of Allah is telling us no. Okay. Likewise, when you look at the, the Salaf al-Salih, you find from the, the consensus of the, the righteous predecessors was hearing and obeying the Muslim ruler. Okay. So that's what our religion tells us in general. Okay. So point number one regarding the rulers is that Allah and His Messenger, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, have given a specific right to our leaders absolutely um uh, that we should obey them absolutely unless it goes against the disobedience of allah of course um so that's point number one 